Hey guys and welcome to Farming Simulator 2017 on Dusty Cove. Well, you've got to take my word for it. I have spent the last two hours trying to sort this, so say, lag issue that you guys experience in the videos. I have updated my recording software. To, um, Relis Action is what I use. Updated it to the latest version. As I suspected, it lags like no other when recording. Well, not when recording, but the video is very glitchy. Some of you experienced that best part of six months ago. Any of the older subscribers will remember I had, for about a week I didn't realise it was doing this, huge lag issues in the videos, and it was straight up lag. Not little bits of frame drops missing. It was very juddery. Um, I updated that, did the same thing as I expected. That's the latest version of Marilla's Action. I rolled back to the older version, which I'm currently recording on right now, and I have been for the last, probably, let's say, five months or so. Whenever I realised that issue was occurring, I went back to an older version, and it's been fine. I'm using exactly the same settings I do as... Uh, actually, I'm using exactly the same settings that Rainbow Dave uses for his videos. We share the same preset. He's literally sent me the same preset. It's a hundred percent the same. I've recorded using this version three times, watched them back every single time. I even watched five minutes of the previous video back from yesterday and I didn't see any lag, drops, FPS stutter. I'm recording at 60 FPS, I'm rendering at 60 FPS, so the FPS is there. I don't know what it is. I'm going to ask Sim what he uses to record. I'll ask Rainbow Dave what he uses to record tonight. But for the next little while, bear with me, guys. There ain't nothing I can do about it. There is absolutely nothing I can do about it if you guys are experiencing it. The only thing I know, I keep saying this, but the only thing that's changed in the last month, bear in mind, I've been using exactly the same settings, unless people are telling me that this has been going on for this long and only now people are saying this. The only thing that's changed is YouTube. YouTube's changed the back end on every single device. Whether it's PC, mobiles, the app basically, consoles, anything you watch YouTube on is updated recently. That's the only thing that's changed. My setup hasn't changed. Graphics card drivers have updated. My software's not updated. My rendering technique's not updated. And it's the same as Rainbow Dave uses, so if you're experiencing lag and you think it's that, go watch his videos. I'm trying to iron it down, that's why I'm spending the first three minutes of this video tr talking to you guys. I'm trying to figure out what's going on, because I'm at a loss. I'm pulling my hair out here, trying to figure out what the issue could be. And I'm running out of options what I can try, what I have access to. The only other option I can go to is OBS, and I just did a test record in OBS, and it looked as pixelated as a camera for probably the early 90s. So, I don't know. Of course, I need to iron out my settings. I'm trying to. Monday's my recording day, and I've eaten half the day away trying to fix this issue. It's a pain in the rear end. Anyway, if you guys bear with me on this one, thank you. It's going to be a pain in the rear end. It's going to take some sorting out and figuring out what on earth's going on. But, as I said, nothing's changed. I have not changed a single setting on my end. So, to me, the limiting factor is one place and one place only. I've had several people. I've asked on my Discord, on my TeamSpeak, to watch the video. Do you see any lag? Most of them come back, no, it's only a very, very select few that say, yes, there is lag. And it seems that the other thing that's changed recently is West Coast. West Coast is the first sort of inkling people, people have said, your videos are lagging. It's all well and good saying, oh, I watched Agawin and his videos are fine. Yeah. <laughs> I. That's what I mean. I, I, I don't know. I'm at a loss. Because I watch my videos back and I don't see any issues. I'm watching them back on my iPod. The lowest device I have, my iPod, my computer, my desktop. Well, my laptop, my desktop, my tablet, my phone. I'm watching it back on all these other devices and I'm not seeing issues. See, on, hopefully you guys can tell my frustrations here. Not frustrated at individual people frustrated at trying to figure out what the issue is there or am I chasing my tail around because there is no issue 
So hopefully you guys can let me know. And the thing I ask mainly is, if it's lagging, give me a timestamp. And people aren't able to give me timestamps and say it's random. If it's random all the time, every time you come back to the video, then it ain't obviously my video. It's YouTube's player. Because if you see it lag, rewind like a sec, say 10 seconds before it happened, does it lag again? If it does, then obviously it's the video. But if it doesn't, and you can't give me a specific timestamp, that's the player. That, that's legit, that's the player. If it's, if it's randomly different times, it's not the actual video itself. And that's the thing I honestly think it is. Because I've had several comments saying, I was just randomly in the video. Well, if it's randomly in the video, how is it me? Because you can't pinpoint it. You can't say it's going to be hap it's happening at 5 minutes and 59 seconds. Or 58 seconds, or 50, whatever. If there's a specific timestamp, please give it to me and I will review this video. Of course, I have uninstalled, reinstalled Maris a few times. I expect this video may be a little clunky. If it isn't, then... Okay, we'll find out tomorrow when I record West Coast. If it's clunky then, then it's West Coast causing my computer to have a fit. And it's that. It's not anything. It's just West Coast being West Coast. Which, certain areas, I do drop a lot of frames on West Coast at times. So it could be that. Right now I'm recording this at 60, 50, 57 FPS right now as I'm coming into the town. And I'm driving all the way back, and hopefully... I've got all the ground seeded. Uh, which is a no. So we actually need to turn around. Oh, really? Come on now. There we go. Oh, seriously? This is what I didn't get. You can see. Yeah. Fresh air through that gap. So we'll get back onto the main main topic of farming. So I don't want to be on that topic the whole entire video. That being said, I don't even know if this video is even going to work. <laughs> Which is the annoying thing. I mean, no doubt everyone has times in their life of their job where they just want to quit and say, screw it. Out of frustration. That's where I'm at right now, to say sort of if my level of frustration. It's, uh, it's there right now. It really is. So, something like that on a happier note. Me, Sim, and the uh, Rainbow Dave are thinking of doing, and it's probably going to happen if I can sort the lag issue out, is Space Engineers series. Hopefully, it'll be something that's going to be pretty cool and people like. I know some of you aren't going to be into it, but that being said, if we've got Sim and Rainbow Dave in there, instead of me not fi knowing what the heck I'm doing, I think it'll be a bit more interesting. I really do. Alright, so, we're going to just set up course play with this. Field 30, that direction. Three headlands after, generate. That will do. First waypoint, off we pop. Actually, do I, what, what do I want you to be seeding? Field 7's barley. Oh crap, I meant to put... Uh, field 7's, as I say, is barley. Uh, we could do the soybeans or something to make us some money. Or oh, soybeans. Uh, 42 is soybeans. 40 is corn. Yeah, we'll make the soybeans or something, these smaller fields. Uh, 
All right, that should be that good to go. Jump into this. Now, I think everything's cultivated that needed to be cultivated last time around. Oh, no. Well, field 30 is going to be fine. We can just go over that. Field 25. And then we're good to go, I think. Now, I remember someone saying last time I was on here that you know you don't need to cultivate because the cedar does it. Obviously, yeah, I do know that. It just adds a bit more to the video instead of just running that across plowed ground. you got to wonder how often a farmer would go across plowed ground right away with a cedar like that. Because surely the, all the balancing, one, it's got to put wear and tear on you, the operator, which a lot of these companies are trying to avoid. And two, the wear and tear on the machinery, because you're going up and down sort of rough ground. And of course you'd probably have to go slower because you are also cultivating while seeding. I've got to wander on that one. Get yeah, to wander. Alright, so field... What field are we going to? What field did I say? Probably this one right here. Yeah, we'll just dip into 23. Which the entrance was back there? Let's spin around in here. Feels like I, I've not been playing this map for ages and I for, basically forget where I'm going. I forgot my way around it. Further from the truth, I've actually been playing this map quite a bit. The videos still. And the elder livestream here and there. Honestly, We'll probably do the silage harvest, because I think a lot of people will enjoy seeing that. And get to through to winter, and I'm honestly, honestly thinking about calling it quits on this map. You may be saying to yourself, why is that? I think it's time's coming, for me personally now. Now, I could be saying that because I'm frustrated. I don't know. Uh, we'll probably reevaluate that. I may record a West Coast video today, and then call it quits more than likely from me recording videos, because um. Not in the right frame of mind right now. But you're not always in the right frame of mind when you're working. And that is the case. That's right, we were rolling this last time around. I think we finished this field. Yeah, it looks like it. I think we did field 42 in the old Missy. And the lock bar sometime today. There it is. This is a lock in the bar. And there's the gate. We have successfully founded the gate. Founded? Wow. Found the gate. English. I'll see if that field does need rolling. It's a big field to roll though, to be quite honest. I may just head over to field 30. It's a smaller field. That field over there will probably spray more than anything. And again, I know realistically you only tend to roll grass in. That being said, I have seen Dino roll uh, wheat in, I think it was. I think. Maybe wrong. But this is a game at the end of the day. Whoa. You want my head off? Sucks too, because I got up today. Right on time, my alarm went off, I got up, sat down recording stuff, nope. 
Just the way it works, I guess. Just the way it works. So a slow old drive down. It's a nice drive though. It's not too bad. Way. What I'll probably do after this video is get this rendering, to be honest. I want to check it out. Get the audio sorted. Render it. As my uh, fancy books goes off. It's because I asked Rainbow Dave and Sim. What do they record on? So it's probably the Rainbow Dave or Sim getting back to me. It was... Mr. Rainbow Dave. I think Sim's all recording as well today. That's the thing for us. Mondays, there are recording days. We get something done over the weekend, typically. And then Monday we sit down and just record all day, typically, until we have dinner. Now, it depends. I know for me and Dave, we're very similar in this respect. It depends how adventurous we're feeling as far as doing multiple videos in one day. Typically two, three, and we're done. And then the later ones in the back end. But I've really got to get some videos done this week because, well, let's just say Gold Rush for next week. I want to get another head start. Which brings on to another topic of all the lag. Did, does that mean my ETS videos lag as well? I'm kind of curious. Or is it just farm sim? Because if it's just farm sim, then is it just the game? Gotta wonder. Gotta wonder. Alrighty, got this unfolded. I was just messaging Mr. Rainbow Dave back. Telling him my woes, per se. I'm basically just... I don't know what to do. Which I don't. I really don't. Of course the live streams are okay. That's one thing. Live streams are still good. So I may end up going down the route. If I can get OBS sorted, I may go down the route of doing that. It, it just limits me. Me being, especially when I'm back in the UK, I love having the ability to pause the video on the flight. Which Mar Marillus, as far as I'm aware, is the only piece of software that gives you that ability to pause on the fly. Well, with this being a noisy background when I record, people are back. The, as anyone knows that's been a subscriber of me for a while, the downstairs toilet gets flushed. It just sounds like a tidal wave of noise coming through on the microphone. I need to have that ability to pause. And using OBS and Audacity at the same time, you can't. I don't think you can set a hotkey up for Audacity. Basically, I'd have to just roll with it and go from there. I mean, that's always the option, to be quite honest, is do it like that again, like I used to with Fraps. Fraps, unfortunately, I would use, but it's hellishly outdated and I don't trust the software anymore. The fact that we've not received an update in so many years, it, it, which is strange, it was the number one recording software out there. They could have made a massive program out of that, but... I don't know, they, for all we know, something bad's happened to the person who was writing the program, which hopefully not, but you never know. Oh, and there's a real professional yawn mids video. Sums up my day. <laughs> Sums up my day in absolute treat. So hopefully going like five mile an hour, we won't be catching up with this guy. This video is probably only going to be about 25 minutes long, to be quite honest, guys. I want to watch the raw video of it back, a good chunk of it anyway, at least. Get it rendered, watch it, uh, have it upload, watch it back again. I'm going to use this one as the experiment, so I don't know how many videos I'll get recorded today. Maybe just be the one, which is not going to be good 
for me wanting to get through a lot of stuff, but this stuff happens, I guess. Just got to deal with it. Ding. Yeah, it's staying a couple of rows ahead. For at least one, I think. So we've got what? Th no, two rows now compared to what it's on. On a side note, though, it's funny just hearing that message come through there. You guys will hear that. There's no doubt about it. I'm not even gonna try and pretend to go and sort that out and mute it. <laughs> but. You hear one device vibrate, then you hear my tablet go off, and, and you guys probably don't hear the vibration on the uh, tablet because it's on another desk. But the delay, they're all on the same network, but one device gets it first and then it filters through the rest, and of course my PC, which, yeah, it was Dave replying back to me, we'll get it at different times, a few seconds between each other. I am surprised with cat caught up. Wonder if it's because it's taken so long on their turns. Well, that could be it. No, I highly doubt you'd be running these two in the field together. There's not a hope in heck you'd ever do this. The only reason I'm doing it right now, guys, is something else to do on the farm. Unless I have two cedars, which we could probably get away with having two cedars. And nothing to do. Other than uh, groundwork. Lots and lots of it. Not too sure what we're doing on West Coast. Oh, we're harvesting, aren't we? We've got the. Yeah, that's a problem. We've got to get a header trailer and figure that stuff out. Which I'll probably need to enable them. Or we can just swap off the. Uh... Oh, that's right. Yeah, the corn header wasn't working properly, too. Crap, I didn't think of that. Because I don't think that head is going to even be able to fit on a uh, header trailer. The fact it's not lifting up fully off the ground. On West Coast. Hmm. Yeah, that's kind of kibosh my ideas right there. We are now exactly one row away. How fast is it going? Oh, we're kind of doing similar speeds. No wonder. So, for anyone wondering, the roller is from the Mod Hub. Don't quote me on this, but I think it was part of the competition. Can't remember. Really not too sure. You can have it do uh, two things. Cultivation is one of them, and fertilizing is in the other. Is the other as a cultivation tool? I just don't see the point personally. It seems very strange to be cultivating with a roller. So I thought for fertilizing would be the best function for it, as well you, you're rolling seed at times. I know that to be true in some cases. Yeah, and we are going to catch up unless it's going to go tearing off. In that case, if we're caught up, we'll probably call it quits here. Just a very short video today. But with the issues I've got to get sorted. Like I say, I'm running the old Marillus again. But I'm tearing my hair out over here trying to figure out what the issues are. If the issues even exist. At this point, I almost want something... I, I want to be able to find what the issue is. So I want to try and produce the best content I can. At the same time, if there's lag issues like that, I'm just running around like a headless chicken trying to chase them. So well and good. Yeah, uh, I'm not going to rehash a topic I've already talked about. <laughs> it's just going to get me more wound up where I need to relax. 
relax and have another coffee already, I think, to tell you the truth. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Sorry for the rant. I hope we can get to the bottom of this. Let me know if you saw anything in this video. Let me know a specific timestamp. If there isn't a specific timestamp, I'm just going to rehash something I did earlier. Then, to me, it seems like it's the browser. If you have multiple devices, you can check. Um, it's kind of a call out for you guys, because it's down to you right now. I, I don't see any lag. Check on another device, if you can. If you've got your phone next to you, and you're watching on a laptop, and you see it lagging on a laptop, pull up your phone, go to that same spot. Does it lag? Yes? Give me the timestamp, and I'll go back and check mine. It's not like I'm trying to say, oh no, it's not doing it because I'm trying to look good or anything like that. I'm trying to get to the bottom of this. I have been for a while, I just don't see any issues myself. So it's hard. It really is. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Sorry for the rants. Hopefully, tomorrow's video will be okay. I'll render this one right now. Check it out. And I don't know. I'm not going to see any issues, I hope. Too many, too major issues. But until next time, catch you guys later. See ya.